what's going on youtube legions gaming here with yes another video i'm gonna be coming at you guys with a lot of videos another question we got a shit ton on the live stream at launch when we had a 250 members live and average about 170 viewers all stream for 15 hours thank you guys so much for that by the way appreciate all the support about 200 new members on youtube 300 new followers on twitch crazy i'm loving the community i'm a huge meme in the discord apparently so you feel free to meme me in the official discord as well um so this video is going to be about printies a lot of people were asking me one of the most quest most asked questions were what do i do with printies are printies fodder do i awaken printies the question is yes make a all printy team okay printies are the most op units in this game not i just i am making a meme team because i'm looking forward to clearing content with an all printy team and just absolutely freaking wrecking everything with it and making content for you guys to make you laugh with the all printy team but yes printy is going to be fodder for your units i'm going to show you guys how in this video without further ado let's get right into it <laughs> Okay, so not only is this going to be a guide on printies, but also just a guide in reincar reincarnation in the first place. A lot of people asked me this question live on stream last night. How to reincarnate, where to go, who do I use, which units are fodder. I'm going to be honest with you. I would only use printy as fodder, all right? There's no rush right now. And a lot of the two stars are actually pretty viable, especially if you have Desco and you can use some of those two star monsters and rank them up. Uh, and, and and get their NEs and their passives and make them pretty strong because you're going to be pulling a lot of two stars when you summon. So I'm going to use my Thief as a reference here because I don't want to use... I, I don't have enough to uh, awaken a four star to a five star right now. I'm still working on that. Um, I spent a lot of time answering questions on chat last night, so I didn't get to play as much as I wanted to. We are going to level up, awaken this Thief from two star to three star. Now doesn't matter if you're one star two star three star four star five star always need five units even if you're going from one to two you need five one star units you're going from two to three you need five two star units so etc keeps going on and on that way if you're using only printies it's literally like to get a character from four star to six star with just using printies I believe my my boy Lids made an infographic. I will try to um, put it on that side there. Uh, Lids87, be sure to give him a follow. Also, content creator. He made this graphic, and it is it is crazy. Twelve hundred, around twelve hundred printies you need to go from four star to six star. So that's what the grind is. So essentially, if you've played Epic Seven before and you use the Phantasms, that's pretty much what the printies are here. They're they're the Phantasms of this game. So, I am going to be using uh, printies. I don't have two-star printies, so for this, I'm going to be using some characters that I have. So, I do have this one two-star printy here, and then I do have some dupe characters here that I'm not going to be using that much. So, I will be using them as fodder. So, now I need five. I need two more. So, I'm going to find some that have a lot of dupes. The rabbit here, and honestly, the cat right there. So, I got five characters selected. I'm going to hit Awaken. As you can see, I get a buff in stats from 2-star to 3-star. I get some more HP, more attack, more defense. Literally everything goes up. And obviously, the higher your rarity, the more stars you get, the more stats are going to be going up. So obviously, 4 to 5 is a big difference. And then 5 to 6 is a huge difference of stat increase. Here, Miles going to do his thing. I'm going to skip this. And I went from 2-star to 3-star. So that is the guide there. So essentially, what I just did with the Thief, you're going to be doing that with printies i'm gonna see if i have a printy that i'm able to use as well i do i do have a printy available i, I don't have five so what you're gonna be doing i, I don't want to use these because i'm building a printy team and i need them so if you're using just printies it's literally the same process you get a one star printy you get five one star printies etc hit the awaken button and you turn this printy from one star to two star then you're gonna need to do this to four more other one star printies and make them two star then from that two star you're going to need to make a bunch of three star you're going to need to make five three star printies etc and so on and so forth and you're going to keep going until you have enough printies to use uh five four star printies 
So that's the grinding process for this game. You can get printies from, I don't think item world. I'm pretty sure you don't get them from item world. You get them from story. You get them from farming events, mainly from story. So that's where you're gonna be. You're probably gonna be getting a lot of these from events as well, um, from the rainbow printies as well work for the NEs. I'll go over that in another video. But this is the main method you're gonna be using for fodder. So yes, printies are fodder, but yes, they can also be used on the team comp so it's whatever you want to do guys but uh thank you guys so much for watching this video feel free to hit that like button subscribe if you haven't already if this video helped you on figuring out figuring out what to do with your printies so i am the printy instructor and i'm here to instruct you on how to get rid of your printies dude so thank you guys so much for watching again thank you for all the support hope i helped a lot of you with this video and make sure you hit that notification bell to be notified for future guides like this. And uh, we're going to be looking into future banners. That's probably going to be the next video. Future banners on what to look out for and what units to be saving for. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next video.